Hey, all you creepers, and welcome back. So, we're starting a new game, which is Gabriel Knight, Sins of the Father. Um, I am a huge fan of this game. This is from the Sierra heydays of, like, the point-and-click adventure games. I grew up on Sierra. I love all of them. Police Quest, King's Quest, Space Quest, 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 and all that stuff. So, I decide... I wanted to play this, which just came out very recently to celebrate the anniversary of, I would assume, 20 years. Oh, cutscene. Shh, let's watch. Oh, there we are. All right. So. And that's the game. Uh, glad you enjoyed. Hope it all uh, was worth watching. Don't forget to share, like, and subscribe. And wait, 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 wait. Let's, let's just go ahead and skip this. It's, credits come at the end of the game, not the beginning, assholes. All right. St. George Books. That's that's my little place of work. I got, I got some motorcycles. I dreamt of blood upon the shore, of eyes that spoke of sin. The lake was smooth and deep and black, and as was her scented skin. Cool. Paper. Well, thank you, paper boy. Okay, so this isn't a blind run. Obviously, I, I've played the game before, and uh, this one I, I definitely tested I, day one and day two just to just to make sure I had my bearings for Sierra games. You got you got to have a certain mindset when mm -hmm. playing these. I bet. Just a minute. Oh, hello, Grace. Oh God, I love his voice. I it forgot lives, about this. It lives. I see. Do you want to speak with Lolita? No, no. I'm sorry, but Gabriel's allowed. <laughs> I mean, he's out. <laughs> you know, you could do better. I know I don't know you, but you could do better. Bye bye Well, aren't, aren't we a little snarky? Good morning. You look like hell. Did you have another nightmare last night? <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Because having nightmares is what I do. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Best voice world. acting. I told you, it's that voodoo book. We're playing in Orleans. That stuff can see. And uh, we're playing, with your playing a white guy. I don't think my readers would go Let's go with that voice. About fluffy bunny rabbits. So voodoo it is. You mean your reader? She lives in Wisconsin, doesn't she? Bite me. Hey, what goes on in your bed stays in your bed, as far as I'm concerned. But um, I have messages for you when you want. Why? Well, thank you. All right. So as as with every Sarah game, first thing you do is you you got you got to look around first. Of course, we're gonna. Boop. Today's newspaper is on the couch. Oh, thank you. And that's the narration we're gonna go. No stereotypes in this game, folks. Okay. So we're going to read the paper. Times dated June 18th, 1993. The Aquarius horoscope says, I'm assuming I'm an Aquarius. Angel storms ahead. Proceed with caution and do not get involved with anything new at this Like a new game? Like a new game like Gabriel Knight? All right. Oh, that sound means we we scored a point. Yay! But, okay. First things first, we got a box here that has stuff in it. So let's go ahead and get all, get all sketchbook. Uh, I think... Oh, we can... Life is too short to talk to ugly statues. You never know it by the women you date. <gasps> oh, snap! Okay, so then we go to counter here. We're gonna look down here. And we're gonna just... We're gonna just peruse the area and pick up some stuff for things we'll need down the road in the adventures. So, as I'm doing this... I'm going to mm -hmm. take the tweezers for a bit. Good. You're beginning to look a bit scruffy. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we'll look at some stuff. I forget what that. But uh, from, the one thing I remembered about like this game, so I looked it up, and uh, they, this game was like 
one of the first games, at least I remember, that had voice acting in it before his text, and that's Not about so it. Lucky for the rabbit, no, 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 no. Um, Grace's resume. Grace's resume. She was way overqualified. Yeah. Um, but the voice the actors in it at the, at at the day were actually really really impressive time. people who Before ended up going on and hopeless. doing like important shit. I swear there was something. Oh, the magnifying glass. That's, that's what I Mind wanted I here. The but the voice glass. actors. Um, no, Sherlock, just and this is. When we get the next estate I think this came out. The 20th anniversary came out last year. Just to date when I'm recording this. Um, so this. So I think the game came out in like 1993. Oh, let's let's get our messages real quick, and then I'll go. I'll ramble off more about the voice Not actors. A minute, right? What? Yep. Voodoo research. Did you find any good So in case I was blabbing on when they were talking the about it. So Gabriel, right? Gabriel Knight is a writer. And the historical museum of. Voodoo. And um. Both are right here in the French Quarter. Pretty. Pretty How much, it's he's trying to write a, a book about a, a fictional book about the devil murders. himself couldn't change you. Well, if the devil had great legs, perhaps like yours, God. and a riveting personality, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. If you need any more research done, just ask. It's not as though we're swamped with customers. Do you have messages for me? Your friend, Detective Mosley, called talkative, isn't he? Especially with you. What did he want? He told me to tell you that his mother's maiden name is Humphrey, and that he left some photos for you at the station, at the front desk. It's about time. Let me guess. This has to do with the voodoo murder. So as right? I was saying, some kind of inside police information. Tr did you trying to get accuracy for his voodoo murders Maybe. book, and when we're done here, we'll head off to the police station. To his readers, you know. Gabriel, you know you'll never put him in your book. Your main character is a female orthodontist. You're going to be reincarnated as a pit bull if you keep screwing with your karma. As long as it's a male pit bull oh. with a real big B. Uh, that's enough. Oh, Thanks. rough, oh, rough. All right, we're done. We're, we're done with... Oh, I had more messages. Well, circle back. Um, oh. Does this mean anything to you? What, the magnifying glass? It makes things look big. Out to impress a girl, <laughs> Hey! I hope you're hey. insulting the size of my brain. <laughs> well, that goes without saying. Oh, at least you got your priorities straight, Gabriel. All right. Uh, blip, 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 talk more. Got a minute, Greg? Mm-hmm. What? What's up? Do you have messages for me? You got a call from someone named Wolfgang Ritter. He was calling from Germany. He told me it was urgent. Maybe you should give him a call. Call Germany? Like hell. If it's really important, he'll call back. Well, fine. Let's just hope he's not with the German lottery for pitiful American authors. Oh, snap. Oh, more messages. Do you have messages for me? Your grandmother Aww. called. I keep meaning to get over there. What did she say? Did she sound good? <laughs> yeah, but... She sounded great. We had yep. a nice little chat about you. Grace. Oh. Don't worry. I didn't go into detail about your cardinal sins. Not that anything about you could surprise her. She adores you anyway. She's my girl. And she sent over that box on the table oh, for the you. the one I already cracked open. So, okay. Um, actually, I think that is all I need from this room. We'll deal with the bookshelf. Oh my god, I'm starting to get an accent. We'll, we'll deal with the bookshelf later after sitting on the porch drinking a mint juniper uh, get at the flashlight. But as I was saying before, the voice actors for this were, were pretty I might big. Need a flashlight. So uh, I want the black shirt as well. Thank you. Um, some of the people that come to mind was, uh, hmm. I believe his I name be was Ephraim Zimbalist, which for those who watched like a lot of the 90s Batman stuff, he played Alfred um, in a lot, a lot of the stuff. So um, that's, that's kind of where I, at least I know him for. And then of course there was uh, Lee, I think her name is Leah Remini, Remini. Uh, she had a show called what's oh there is stuff i want to hear. i don't need nope. to uh she played she was one of the co-stars or one of the main characters in king of queens and she's done some shit that people know her for I'll take this then there was of course a guy named michael you thorne you need a um he is a lot of sci-fi nerds will remember that name i think he has a tv show coming out in the near future that you'll 
recognize him on. Um, I think people most notably know him for the voice of Goliath on the old gar- Disney uh, Gargoyles. Then there is Mark Hamill, who is another famous for- voice actor for uh, the Joker, and I think he did some sci-fi stuff back in the day as well. And of course, the great Tim Curry, which I don't think I don't think you kids know too much about him. Leave my coat alone, Oops, Gabriel. Sorry. Um, but he was most notable for his part in Home Alone 2. So those were so those those were some pretty big names. But I'm going out. We're Don't done here, so we're gonna account. we're gonna move along here and go ahead and hit the police station. Boom boom. The sounds of motorcycles. Alright. So police station we go. And enter the police station. And there's not much we want to do here except talk to Frick. Got a second, officer? What can I do you for? Uh, first thing, photographs. I was supposed to pick up some photos from Detective Mosley at the front desk. Is that right? And who are you? My name is Knight. Gabriel Knight. Yeah, I got something for you, all right. As soon as you're done talking, I'll give it to you. Uh, th- sweet. I'm here to see Detective mm-hmm. Mosley. He's out at a crime scene. Ooh, Sorry. crime scene? Why don't... Where's the crime scene? Is it related to the voodoo murders? Crime scene information is police confidential. We don't need any more looky probably. <laughs> Whoa, he puts some extra stank on that looky loose. Oh. What can you tell me about the voodoo murders? I'm not allowed to give out information on police cases. His voice sounds familiar too. God, that's gonna bother me. I know, I, I know he's done stuff that people may know. Just hold on. Now, now I gotta. Who me? I'm the desk sergeant, Frick. Why, Frick? That's right. You got a problem with that? Not at all. Yeah, he he's definitely. Oh, maybe they got some somewhat notable people here and probably by the time this comes out I have already looked it up and have probably put the name of what he's known for Gabriel Knight. here Thanks. yep that's what he's known for so all right let's uh, get out of here and so I got the photographs that my buddy Mosley wanted to give to me uh, we're gonna head to Jackson Square now because he's at a crime scene and involves the voodoo murders and I'm doing a book on voodoo murders so I am very very interested in that however I have no idea where to look so yep so the dispatch and I'm cutting through this because you guys I I'd be sitting there for like five minutes just you know third of this video just trying to oh hello uh, oh we're gonna have to wait for you to come back so what I'm pretty much doing is it took me a while to figure this out and I'm skipping through all that just so I need to You white face geek, you wanna eat my fist? Buff dude. Cajun band. Woman. Horse. Shut up and get on my horse. So the dispatch on that motorcycle on on the motorcycle Since bike. Gabriel can't read lips. He's disinclined to start a conversation. Oop. Uh, maybe I want to look. It's one of those mimes. Oh boy. Oh boy. So, yep. Now the mime's following me. No, no. But I gotta, I gotta dodge all these people because th- where the dispatch was going off was down here. But this police officer will not let me look at the radio because he did, we don't, we don't. There we go. So if only I had a way to distract him with something very annoying, like a mime. Hey, cut that out. I told you to stop that. Oh. All right, mister, you want some of this? Why, you little. Oh, no. Okay. Um, oh, now the police officer isn't here. So now I'm going to look at the radio. Gabriel picks up the headset and listens. Where's the... Oh. Did you say it was north of the Lake Retreat Country Club? South, Lakeside Drive, north of 
Get away from oh, that Oh, oh, nothing, nothing, oh, no, nothing. Good. Sorry. My bad. And that's all I really needed here. So, this is kind of why I wanted to do a, a dry run because with this game when I first picked up for a while, because you, you gotta, you gotta get inventive with these Sierra games. They give you clues and shit, of course, but, but it, it, it would have taken me a much, much longer time to figure that out. So, now, We'll uh, exit out of the French Quarter, and hey, look at that, a crime scene. But this is just the opener, so I'm going to go ahead and stop here. Hey, mostly. Huh? Mate, you wiener, I told you not to call me that. Oh, you wiener. Really jump in? Who, me? Don't be stupid. We'll, we'll go ahead and wait How'd a second. Find me? Oh, I was just driving by. Uh-huh. Mm. Well, I guess I can let you see it. For the book, but don't tell anyone, huh? And this is how he made detective. Ah, uh, well, you're here. Want to see a dead body? Definitely another voodoo murder. Same M.O. and no freaking clues. We're still waiting on an ID for the body. Mm. Oh, that's disgusting. Isn't this a rather public area for this kind of thing? Yeah, they're freaking ghosts, these guys. Lakeshore Drive isn't exactly the 10 expressway, but it is open to the public. No reports or nothing. No reports or nothing? What are we ever gonna now, do? Who the hell is that? Oh, it's a, <laughs> it's a plot piece, that's what it is. Oh, cut, another cutscene. Oh, how are you doing? <laughs> Good day, Miss Gettys. <laughs> Slow What's smile on, creeps across Gabriel Knight's face. Detective Mosley, ma'am. Uh, we got a little problem here, but nothing for you to be concerned about. I see. Thank you, Detective. And. Good day, gentlemen. I'm in love. Forget it. That's Molly Getty. She's about as far out of your reach as the moon. Probably <laughs> on her way to meet some guy with a yacht right now. Near here? The lake's a popular place for country clubs. If she's out here a lot, maybe she saw something or heard something. Nah, nobody ever sees or hears nothing. I told you. Besides, you just don't go around bothering people like her. We've about wrapped it up, sir. <laughs> well, let's get the meat wagon moving then. Stick around and take notes for the book if you want. Watch Th out for thank the you much, water sir. moccasins, though. If you want to talk, I'll be at the station tomorrow. Thanks. Alright, see you guys. Thanks. Alright. So, we got a crime scene that we're going to be able to look at because, uh, because the police just kind of said, fuck it, I don't care. So I will do that next time. I will see you guys then.